WB News Talk 980. Welcome to the show we call Living the E-Life. I'm Jeff Levy, your E-Life coach. In the last segment, we were talking about the uh, the heavy weight of going to college, the expenses. And, of course, books are always a big thing. See, it's not a fair market because the student has no input into what book to buy. He's, he or she's told, that's the book. Now, going to college can be a very daunting thing. I've invited a gentleman by the name of Mike Pocatera to join us and tell us about this website. It's called cram101.com. Michael, welcome. Thank you very much. What's your background? I'm an investment banker. I've been in Wall Street for over 50 years. Uh, I've uh, looked at uh, taken a lot of companies public in my career. Um, uh, I had a, owned a brokerage firm here in Los Angeles, H.J. Uh, Myerson Company. We raised, we did five hundred million dollars of uh, money that were raised for new companies, and so I was always on the watch for the up and coming coming companies, and that's how I discovered Cram. So, uh, how did you meet with uh, Cram, and who's behind it? Cram, Cram, I met about three years ago, and I met Dr. Scott Parfit, who greatly impressed me when I first met him. Um, it was a little over my head, because <laughs> tech wasn't really my forte, but Dr. Parfit has a most interesting career. Back in the 70s, he self-taught himself uh, how to program computers when I didn't even know what a computer was. And uh, and then in, uh, he developed uh, some programs, developed a company, sold the company successfully, and then in the uh, uh, in at the turn of the century, 2000, uh, he started on Cram 101. He's a former college professor. He earned his doctorate at uh, Notre Dame University. Uh, and um, he's, so he's an educator, a tech guy, one of the, and, and a CEO. All of the things I look for for a successful company. I got to tell you, Michael, when you say the turn of the century, my <laughs> mind flashed to the 1900s. That's terrible. I know. Mind you, too, for a second. I and I like the that. word cram when it comes to not yelling at somebody and giving them a verb, but rather to study. So tell me about cram101.com. What's the what's the purpose of the website? Well, what does it do? Well, here's what we did. We realized that the cost of books was becoming so prohibitive, and what we decided to do was to begin to to uh, build a library of our textbooks. And in our library, we now have 18,000 college textbooks. So These are you, textbooks that are in use in colleges. Absolutely. That are in, only in use in colleges at the present time. And what you can do is when you go on, on our website is you can pick out your textbook, go highlight it, bring it up on your screen, and then chapter by chapter you'll find the keywords for the, for each, uh, in each chapter that have meaning. And a lot of the uh, – when you go into the website itself, when you bring up the chapters, there's a little blue highlight. If you hit the blue highlight, it will then take you to a deeper and deeper uh, education. And if it's on the math side, it will actually explain to you. It would be like you and I, you be my professor, and me sitting across from you and saying, how do I learn this formula? How did you do it? In there, you can just do it all technologically with your mouse. So, so it's like having a one-on-one -on -one with the author of the book or the college professor. Or the college professor. So this gives you a different bent. When you walk into that classroom, you're not unarmed anymore. No, nope. you're prepared now for what's going to be. And in fact, the reason why Dr. Parfit developed this in the first place, he said, I got sick of looking at the heads, the tops of kids' heads. So, oh, that's what, funny. What, that's yeah. funny. So what I did was I decided I, if I could just create key words and they could have something in front of them, they could just get the essence of what I'm teaching. And then they could go back and copy it into their computer as their computer, as their notes. When test time comes, they would be prepared. But then he went one step further. He put on every chapter five types of exams that you can take when you go on Cram 101. So you can take a multiple choice or uh, all, uh, five different ways to go about it. And once you see that you mastered those exams, and it'll correct you right then and there. And if on you, the fly. On the fly. And if you made mistakes or were wrong, it will tell you what you made mistakes, and you can go back in and see what the right answers were. So... I, my theory always has been, if you can master, an, if you do well in an exam, the probability is you've mastered the, the theme, the, 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 the subject. And so we thought that would help kids get a big jump on number one. Uh, it, it makes them more uh, prepared for the exam. I remember when I was in college, you know, I used to cram, <laughs> right? The night before. Didn't we all? We didn't. We, we crammed the night before. We try to regurgitate what we learned. And now you can do it all on your iPhone. You can do it all on your computer. 
and it's simple stuff. It's and you just, can do it on any tablet, any tablet, any, any iPod, smartphone, a, any 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 electronic device. It's quite a concept. I, I'm really happy with it. Now I went on the website and I took a look at some of those textbooks. You've got eighteen thousand textbooks. I looked at some of the outlines. It's almost like a crib notes, like a cheat sheet, <laughs> only better because somebody with the level of skill that the professor has has gone through and done it for me. That's exactly right. That's exactly right, and it makes it easier. You don't get you don't get so uh, plussed by the exams. I think it allows the student to take his time and to absorb the material. And when he's through, he's got the best tool that I know that's available for the process of learning, which is what education and college should be all about. And that's what intrigued me so much about what Dr. Parfit had developed. So uh, you're keeping up to date because I know there are new textbooks. That's another scam. We, they roll out these new textbooks that really haven't changed much, but they create a revenue stream, revenue stream for the publisher. That, we know what's going on. They're not fooling us. And that's what most colleges are complaining about today. And that's why the evolution now of the ebook is coming very rapidly. Our partner is Barnes and Noble. Uh, we will. They're one of our partners that we do the ebook with. And we'll uh, very rapidly, uh, as that catches on, uh, we'll be right, we're right in that same scope. Uh, we partner with Amazon. Uh, our books are all on Amazon. Our books are on uh, several of the large uh, resellers. And in fact, Chegg, that you mentioned earlier. You're partnered uh, with them uh, as well. With, with them as well, that's right. Do you see a day, uh, Michael, when textbooks will become electronic so that no more Book bags with 40 pounds worth of paper. <laughs> You're schlepping that around from class to class. Do you think that'll happen? I absolutely do. It's funny that you said that because we did actually a commercial with a professional uh, guy who does movies. And but one of the things we did with the quick squib was showing a girl who's hunched over with her eight textbooks in her in her backpack. And she was saying, oh, my God, my back is killing me. And he said, well, you, why don't you just go to Cram 101? You don't have to carry any textbooks. You have, you have, your, you have your iPhone. You just need to put your iPhone. Lovely. IPad. So what does it cost? The cost of it, $25. It's going to cover all of your textbooks, all of the exams, all of the chapters, everything that you're going to need to help get your grades Can't up. So moms and stick. dads are going to have an opportunity as well to be able to help their kids because moms and dads are going back to school too now. Yeah, with this economy, that's certainly an option, especially when there's some government money available to do it. Yeah. I went back to school. I start teaching at Santa Monica <laughs> College tomorrow. My students are in for a surprise. I'm not a very ordinary instructor. I'm quite not predictable. Michael, again, the website. The website is cram, C-R-A-M, the number 101.com. Lovely. We'd like to have you back again in a few months. We'll kind of see where cram is and what it's doing. Thank you so much. Okay.